morning students good morning everyone this is your class 2 science class your fourth chapter chapter to uses of plants already started and the uh, fibers from plants and wood from, uh, from plants we already learned about this right for so today we proceed for medicines of plants this is a important thing very very important that we get from plants because we all uh, know that medicine is the very important and useful things so uh, the many medicines we just get uh, from some some plants leaves or uh, some plants uh, roots okay so uh, we when we which medicines we take that maximum is the uh, we get from plants and, and the chemical laboratory that we all uh, process the procedure doing and after that we get it in our hands by uh, with the new form of tablets or a form of some um, powder but here there are some medicines also which we get direct from the plant Right, so that's a very helpful. We are uh, in Ayurveda, chicken, Ayurveda uh, uh, medicines, which we already, uh, which we know that we some uh, plants, uh, some leaves of plants, some roots of plants that are that are very uh, useful for us. We can take it as a medicine. Okay, we can take it as a medicine. But every medicine which made from uh, parts of plants. So here we know we have to know now that uh, which uh, uh, plants and from which part we get those medicines and we can use it uh, without prescription and we can use it in our primary treatment. Okay. In our primary treatment, we all uh, try at our home, at uh, home. Okay. So now we we'll go for the page number fifteen, the medicines from plants. So today we learned about this, and we have to remember is this. This is a very helpful to us when we didn't get any uh, medicines and those supplements. We use these things. So we get medicines from some plants. Such plants are called medicinal plants. So in our area, we have already such medicinal plants. Which uh, was there are some two plants which uh, maximum in our home. So this is a medicinal plants. That's medicinal. We call them medicinal plants because we get medicines from those. The first we can say is see the dried roots of muleti. Muleti, the name of English is liquor rice. Liquor rice, which uh, the dried roots, which we which is very useful like a medicine, and the juice of tulsi leaves. You um all I all may can see this tulsi tree in our home in every home maximum home. We uh, uh, use uh, we plant these tulsi leaves, the tulsi trees. Okay, tulsi plants we uh, plant it, but and those leaves are very useful, very medicinal from us because this juice of leaves is medicine for us, and if we eat it, we can cure our cough and cold. Okay, so these dried fruits of muleti and juice of tulsi leaves helps us to cure cough and cold. If you get colded already, you can eat this juice of tulsi leaves. If you have this tulsi leaves, you can use this. You can uh, uh, put uh, put on these leaves and you can eat this. And you can also dry fruits of muleti eat this. So those two things cured us from cough, cough and cold. Okay, so that is very helpful for us because uh, from our every house that we can see this tulsi tree. And next, the option two you can see at the page number 
sixth theme you can follow this in your book the leaves of the and seeds of dhrutura they uh, from leaves and the uh, dhrutura tree we can see in the uh, uh, the this is the herbs uh, the examples of how so we can uh, see not so much but its leaves and seeds leaves and seeds is a uh, is make use uh, use uh, the medicines those things so you can make the medicines and it is uh, help us to cure asthma and bronchitis this is the these two are the um, diseases uh, which we uh, which we occur in our uh, lungs so those two things uh, is a very dangerous disease for humans and those the medicines which is made for leaves and seeds from dhutura tree we can uh, uh, speak in bengali as dhutura okay that's in english the dhutura dhutura this uh, from this tree from this leaves and seeds helps us we make this medicines for asthma and bronchitis because this medicines helps us to cure only asthma and bronchitis the uh, disease of the lungs okay and next the third is you can see the leaves of uh, seeds oil of neem we already uh, uh, see this neem tree right and the previous uh, chapter we learned about the neem tree this is a big tree and have a big trunk and that this neem tree which every parts is very useful every parts its uh, leaves is most important things most useful things of neem tree and its seeds also if there are some fruits that is very small fruits we can see in this neem tree and from uh, those seeds from those fruits that make oil which we call neem oil right from those seeds we made neem oil and those two things are very very important very very useful for us and those to help us to cure fever those leaves and oils also uh, cure us from any skin problem any hair problem any skin problem or any medicine main problem which we can cure this means if we use it every day this wound can cure this so these leaves and seeds are very useful for us and it cure from fever also and also it cure our skin problem hair problem or any wound okay so this neem tree those the leaves and the oil of seeds are very useful and next you can see the turmeric powder we all have this in our kitchen right turmeric this powder we use for cooking for every cooking we use it this is a very very useful things that's why we use it in our food when we cook our food we use turmeric powder but this powder we can also use in our wound if we our any body was wounded we can use on it on any sprain sprain is the uh, twist of ligament in our body first we have bone side right? we have 206 bones and there are also some ligaments and in those ligaments if we need or playing in the ground if after if we uh, get down or if we fall down that that uh, time our may happen that ligaments is twisted and in this area in this twisted there is very much pain will be occur the very much pain you can feel this so if we uh, use that turmeric powder in uh, in that area in that wounds it could be cured right it could be cured by using the turmeric powder so there are some medicinal herb trees the first one the mulberry trees tulsi trees dhatura trees neem trees and turmeric trees those plants we call the medicinal plants because we get medicine from it 
and we also get more medicines from many plants many medicinal plants you uh, will know about this after so now we have to read this only these four trees and their uh, which are which parts of those trees we have to use we can use and why we can use who what helps us how helps us how to cure us also right so you have to write then you have to read this very very attentively i repeat this once again for the next class but till now till today you have to read from your textbook you can write like this in your copy book also okay so thank you everyone read this very attentively in your home and also remember this because they are really important okay